Greetings Orphanites and welcome once again to our filmmaking vlog here on the OrphanMovie.com. As always, I'm your host and uh, we got something a little different this time. Instead of the typical uh, movie making topic, we're going to be uh, doing just kind of a general update, let y'all know where we're kind of at and, and with things right now. Uh, we're still in the pre-production, slowly moving towards production, but I wanted to give you a bit of a heads up on what we got going on. Uh, a little more specifically than what I've just kind of mentioned in passing in the last few vlogs. Uh, this last weekend I started working on the script again. I've uh, started uh, marking out things. I've been kind of kind of ruthless in my editing a little bit this time around. Uh, I think this is going to be a really good version of the draft, uh, of the story. I kind of held off this long on it uh, because I wanted to have a little more of a firm idea of what we were going to have in the way of a location. Uh, that we're going to be using for the interiors of the orphanage. The uh, reason for that's the uh, original location that was the inspiration for the story is what I had in mind when I wrote the first couple of drafts. And uh, since we're not using that location, I didn't really want to alter the script, not knowing what we were going to have that we we're going to be able to use. And I uh, felt like it was going to be kind of doing double work once I did have an idea if I went ahead and did another draft first. Uh, as I mentioned in the last uh, vlog, uh, we do have a verbal agreement on a location that we're going to be using for the interiors of the orphanage. Uh, it's actually going to be a really good location for us. It's uh, got a lot of the a lot of the things that I was looking for in a location, uh, so I feel like we really got lucky on that. Uh, it's a multi-level building. It's extremely, uh, extremely large. Uh, there's a lot of different looks there, so I'm really excited about the uh, fact that we're going to be able to film there. Uh, it's going to be completely enclosed. That's one of the a couple of the other locations we looked at. That was going to be one of the problems we had is that there was a lot of the, uh, open doors and windows that were missing, and other openings in the building that were going to be a problem to close off as far as. Uh, giving us a more controlled environment to work in. So this work, this uh, place we're going to be at now is, is really going to be working extremely well for us. Of course, uh, if we were one of the big players, we'd have the money to just go somewhere and rent a space and build all of that, but we haven't even got either the time or the money or manpower for that sort of thing. So I'm real happy with what we've got lined up. Uh, there's another location that I'm wanting to use for the exteriors of the orphanage. I finally got a line on the uh, owner of that property. I've got the contact information for him now and I'm going to be able to uh, finally get with them, see if we can get permission to uh, actually enter the property to be able to film there. Uh, another location that we're going to be using is actually where we're at right now. Uh, this is our house and it's going to be one of the locations we're going to be using. Uh, dining room I'm sitting in right now is actually going to be where one of the scenes is going to be taking place. So when you actually see the film, if this looks familiar, that's the reason why. Uh, on other things, there's uh, the production company we were uh, in the process of putting together. I've still got a little bit of uh, research I'm wanting to do on uh, the uh, limited liability company before I actually do the filing for that, but I'm hoping to do that pretty soon here. Uh, once the script is uh, finished being uh, edited and I get it put into the uh, into uh, the screenwriting software I'm using Celtics. I'm hoping to be able to finally firm up a location to do auditions. I'm really wanting to be, be able to do those with within the next few weeks here. Uh, far as the uh, other things that are going on, there's uh, a couple of things we're looking at doing with the website that we're hoping to get going pretty soon, and uh, we're also going to be having to do a crowdfunding campaign and there's some things I'm looking to into as far as that. Uh, that's still kind of up in the air as far as specifics, but once we get more uh, things in line on that, we'll be letting you know uh, when that's going to be and how you can help out. I think that's about all we have this time around. Like I said, it's just kind of a general quick update. You can contact us at our email, which is realorphanmovie at gmail.com. We welcome all comments, questions, suggestions. Uh, we're on social media, uh, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, The Orphan Movie. And I think that's about all we got this time. Hopefully next time this will 
be able to back to our regular topics. I'm going to see if I can get a Jacob to sit down with me and do a little bit of technical uh, talk next time, maybe. But we'll see you next time. Join us here once again, theorphanmovie.com.